With the second pick in the 2020 NFL Draft, the Washington Redskins select Chase Young, defensive end, Ohio State. But you know as they say, hail to the Redskins. Let's roll, man. Let's go. Welcome, all my fellow Redskin brethren and sister. Ah, and your man and resident Redskins fan, Lou. Thank you for joining me here on the Red Skins Report. I can't even contain how excited I am right now. You know what? It's 2.36 in the damn morning. I need to take my ass to sleep and I can't. You know why? Because I'm so excited about the Redskins finally making it official and bringing the Predator home. The decision to draft Chase Young was easy. But these NFC East quarterbacks about to go down hard. I'm excited. I don't want anything from you, okay? We've talked about this situation ad nauseum, okay? All I want to know is down in the comment section of this video, how you reacted to the selection of Chase Young. How excited were you? Maybe you weren't excited. Maybe you wanted the Redskins to trade out. Maybe you wanted the Redskins to take Tua. Whatever the case may be, leave it in the comment section. I want to know, when the Redskins made it official, what was your reaction? Mine is documented on YouTube, on my channel, on my draft party, okay? I tried to contain myself a little bit, but it was hard. I was excited, all right? But the fact that I'm doing this at 2.30, now 8 in the morning, lets you know I was euphoric. I was still on cloud nine. And at some point, I'm going to close my eyes tonight, and I'm going to wake up tomorrow and realize it wasn't a dream. We got Chase Young, and now, and you know, I almost feel like we won something. We didn't win a goddamn thing, okay? I'm acting like we won a Super Bowl or something. But... I feel like this could be the foundation. This could be the start of something young, fresh, and new in the nation's capital. And I'm glad to say that I was here when it happened, and I want to see this thing all the way through. So leave it in the comment section. How did you react? Where were you? How did you take it in? What was your reaction to when the Redskins officially made the pick of Chase Young, number two overall in the 2020 NFL Draft. Look, don't be overjoyous, okay? Celebrate, as I always tell you, celebrate, all right? Be excited, but we got more work to do. We got a lot of work to do. We got a, a whole entire six rounds of, of the draft left, but we haven't won a single game. Chase Young has not put a single quarterback on his back with the football still in hand or without, if he's forced to fumble, which I assume he's going to force many of those throughout his career. He still hasn't done anything. We haven't won anything. We've got a long way to go. But I must say, this feels damn good. After everything we struggled for last year, and it was a long, arduous, absolutely grueling season last year to go 3-13 and 13 and sit through the nonsense that we did, two different head coaches, three different offenses, it was a mess, but you know what? We got through it, and this was the payoff. I feel damn good. No one's going to make me feel any other way about it. Leave it in the comment section. I am a Redskins fan, etched in burgundy and gold. My Redskins spirit will never die. Redskins spirit will never fold until we meet again. Hail to our beloved Redskins. Hey, guess what? We got Chase Young. <laughs> we got the Predator. Boy. He got some prey in the NFC East. And I do want to say this. As much as we are sworn enemies, hearts heavy for Dak Prescott tonight. Apparently, he lost his brother yesterday. I wouldn't wish that on anybody, man. The man already lost his mom. Now he's going to have to bury his brother at the age of 31, senseless. Whatever happened, doesn't matter. Shouldn't have happened. Um, prayers go out to him and his family, man. And on that note, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Join me for the draft party. We got a lot to discuss. What's going to happen with Trent Williams' situation? I still say, man, the Vikings got 87 picks in this draft, man. That's the team they need to be targeting to try to move Trent Williams and offload him. 
and pick up some draft capital in the process. We'll see if they're able to get that done or not in day two of the draft. I'll see you guys then. Have a good one. Stay safe. Like this video. Subscribe to Louis T Network. Make sure you're following me on IG, Louis T Network underscore. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good one. Louis T Network.